dragonflies are all and like, around. And like, I thought it was a bird. I thought it was a bird. Wait, bird. Did not know what happened. Guys are... Uh, today we're we're doing a bio blitz of the Rio Hondo channel, and a bio blitz is basically a survey of for wildlife, plants, animals, in a Lo specific location for a specific amount of time. We chose this location because it's an underserved area generally, even with regards to research and science, it's understudied. So for those two reasons, we kind of want to document what's here from a scientific perspective and from a scientific interest but also we want to use this data and upload it on a map so that people in this community know it's here so that they know that nature lives all around them in their neighborhood regardless of how urban it is. I'm, I'm, I'll be around and I'm looking as well. <laughs> a little jumping spider. Being a little shy, hiding in the bottom of the vial here. We are having the very first partnership between the library and the um, museum. And so we're doing citizen science programming here today and getting people excited about nature. We've been doing bug hunts, we've been doing scavenger hunts, we've been doing squirrel puppetry, showing people some of the creatures that we found from the museum's researchers, and just getting people excited about nature, but then going that next step further, trying to get them to participate in citizen science. So all of the bugs that we're collecting today, were these were all found by kids in and around the library, and then we've taken a picture of every single one of them and then they can be added to our LA Nature map or to our reptile and amphibian project, squirrel survey, or to our snails and slugs of living in uh, Southern California project. Then our scientists can use that as data points and help us to understand the nature in the city better. And that data will eventually get used by conservation organizations and urban planners so we can build a better city that's gonna work better for humans and for wildlife at the same time.